Whoever said that patience was a virtue may have been onto something. Jed York played the waiting game and got his guy. The announcement came via the team's official Twitter account. All right, what about the 49ers? They officially announced that Kyle Shanahan uh, is the team's next head coach. Yeah, this deal has just become official with the 49ers announcing that Kyle Shanahan is now officially their head coach. First of all, I mean, you look at this Atlanta Falcons offense, I mean, they've been rolling. I mean, he's right in line. He should be. Uh, one of the hot names out there for the for head coaching job. Today is the first full day for Kyle Shanahan as a new head coach of the 49ers. At age 37, this is Shanahan's first crack at being a head coach in the NFL. He comes to San Francisco after two seasons as the offensive coordinator for the Atlanta Falcons. Kyle's been around football his entire life. He's watched his dad run an organization, be the CEO of the Broncos and then the Redskins. Our NFL Network insider Ian Rappaport yeah. tells us both Shanahan and new GM John Lynch signed six-year deals. Oh, yeah. There you go. <laughs> 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 Start lifting again. <laughs> oh, that's that is great, awesome. man. That is awesome. That is really it's probably be embarrassing for me to try this on right now. <laughs> yeah, that is cool. I'm definitely gonna wear this. <laughs> <laughs> when I'm alone, I don't see it. I gotta get back in the way room first. <laughs> we'll show these guys a yeah. quick aerial view and then. Thank you guys. Um, we're going to make this organization proud by the way we go to work. We know it's not going to be easy. It's going to take a lot of work, but, but I promise you it'll be worth it. And everything we put into this, no matter how long it takes, no matter how hard we got to do it, we're going to do it the right way. Thanks. Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, thank you for joining us today. It's my pleasure to introduce two great gentlemen that are going to help bring us back to where we belong. I must take a moment to show my appreciation to Jed, uh, Danielle, the entire York family uh, for, for really showing the confidence in Kyle and I. Talking about the 49ers, though, it's, it's always been a special part of my heart. And you know, I moved out here in sixth grade where I have a very high expectation of what I've always thought this franchise is. And that was the best franchise in sports. I understood what a great organization this was. I had the opportunity to play for Bill Walsh. Uh, at Stanford and uh, really just was enamored with the 49er organization. It's not easy to win in this league. It's not easy at all, but when you have everyone going the same direction, uh, that's what gives you a chance. They won the press conference, I'll tell you that. I mean, this was all good feelings in San Francisco, and even the local media has to at least to come and say that these guys are impressive. Joining us now in studio on 49ers Live, a special guest that needs no introduction. He'll get one anyways. 49ers general manager John Lynch. You used a phrase in the presser that I thought was fabulous because it resonates being the senior on this panel here, I can say. Is you get to a point in life when you decide to do things, you bet on people. You use that phrase. I love that. Yeah. Talk about betting on people in your decision to do this. Well, I, you know, I think that's when Kyle and I first hit it off. I think it's reflected that it is a true partnership. That's how we're going to ride. And like Kyle said, we're going to win together, we're going to lose together. And um, we got that commitment from ownership. And, and that, that's, you know, the challenge is keeping it like that. I understand that. And, uh, but that's what we intend to do. The key in San Francisco, the whole thing, was that there was unison. And there was a, a marriage, and they're now tied to each other with contracts, but also on the same page. They know each other, they respect each other, you know, uh, that's it. 